Tim, I gotta get some water. You said some stuff, man, that you said a lot of things about, uh, well, you know how I feel about, I'm pretty sure you know how I feel about other people acting out, being assholes or whatever you want to call it. When people are negative, when people are, give me a second, I'm going to pour this and I'll be able to focus this thought. People are. I watched Tom's video too. Hey Tom. I haven't really talked to Tom much yet. Interesting guy though. When people come at you and you're like, they're like, hey motherfucker. And you walk on and they come up. I said, hey motherfucker, I'm gonna find you. That kind of behavior. And then you call the cops and say, this guy needs attention. Really, that guy needs attention. So give him attention. Don't, no need to call the cops. The cops are there, they're construction, but give the guy attention. If they're calling you motherfucker, listen to him. Listen to him. It's going to be a little awkward, uncomfortable, but listen to him. And he'll stop calling you motherfucker. And he'll start seeing that you're a real guy, a peaceful guy, and want to be friends with you ultimately. He probably want to be friends with you from the beginning. Saw some intelligence in you, which is why he was hassling you. Because he wasn't able to hassle the other people. He felt walls with the other people, but with you, he felt comfortable expressing his twisting, kind of untwisting. Expressing his negative energy. So, I think it begins with us dealing with this stuff. YouTube can't solve it. The government may may equal an opposite, but it may not be the government. It could just be the other people or the other person. Like the government's kind of become such an abstraction lately. It's really the people, and like really how the people respond. Laws, I think, will become localized. If laws can become real-time, we'll have an effective law system. Like laws that change as the days go, as the hours pass, to best represent the mass choice. I don't fear the government. I see it as a megaphone. But... If it gets too extreme, then there's a natural response. I don't know if that'll happen, though. I think we can maintain our own dichotomy within the self so that other people don't push against us. Like, if I, if I struggle myself enough, other people don't push at me. If I go full on in one direction, then people push back in the opposite direction. But if I go and show that I am in both directions, it seems to satisfy wildly abstract what I've been talking about just now, dude. Um, really, the whole reason I made this video response is because you said something about the YouTube community that struck me. And, uh, Sorry that it was so, what I said was like, la, 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 just a, a few minutes ago, but feel free to go back and rewatch it a couple times or a few times, because it really does make sense. It's just like, I, it, I was apparating in, in aspects of the superposition and showing you this, 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 and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. But it's all part of the whole. The YouTube community, I see as the nucleus of the atomic structure of the website. And everyone knows this without words. The people, Google knows this. And it has, although it isn't where the action seems to take place, seems to take place, the action seems to be taking place on the outskirts with all these things that have a million views and 500,000 views and, you know, 5,000 comments, etc. The, there is action in the nucleus. It's just not as perceptive. The electrons is where you see all the movement, but the nucleus is where the power is. And such is with the community, the voices, the individuals that stand up, that sit up, down, all these directions. Up is a representation of our earthen behavior. There's only forward <laughs> and back and, you know, it's heightened. We stand heightened. 
we elevate our surroundings, our vibrational undertone or tone. It's there, it's present. We are the community. If it should be, if it must be, we have the power. The mass follows us. For we are the thinkers. We're the root. I could go on and on and develop this group. I think it's time. It's difficult to do it when I'm sitting here in my house alone. Well, Chris is here upstairs, but I'm alone here. It's difficult to pull the group together in my mind when it's just me. If there were six other people here in this room, it would be pulled. It would be happening in them. I can only bring a portion of it. As with you, I can only bring a portion of it. But together, we have it. Okay, it goes on from here, man. See ya.